This is a video about photographing reflections in glass, architectural photography. There are a lot of different kinds of reflections that you've probably noticed of buildings and other buildings, but also reflections of the landscape around buildings, the sky, and some of the things that we see in nature. The best place I've found to photograph reflections in glass are downtown areas. So I've illustrated here a site in Indianapolis, Indiana, and there are a number of tall buildings with reflective glass. So I just situated myself between them and waited for a sunny day. This first group of photos was taken in front of a government building on a plaza. When taking photos of these reflections in buildings, you're probably going to be shooting into glass buildings that have a curtain wall system, which is a glass system mounted to the structure of the building. And as such, you're going to be capturing images in a grid. So aligning the grid and composing the photograph is an important aspect of this type of photography. This is an example in downtown Louisville, Kentucky, of the Humana building designed by Michael Graves. It's a very well-known architectural design building. This is an image, the final image that I captured of the Humana building, reflected in another modern building across the street by Harrison and Abramovitz, a New York firm, a much earlier work which is representative of the international style or modeled after Mies van der Rohe's work, for example. I found this contrast in modern styles from for example, international style to postmodern to be interesting and worth photographing. These are some other examples of buildings reflected in other buildings. Another type of interesting reflection is the landscape. Or as shown here, the building reflected in ice or water. And lastly, how the building reflects the sky or clouds. If you like this video, please consider subscribing. Thank you.